Hi guys, rather pleased with the stomp cannon I made just now for shooting easter eggs around. So on a slightly different tack I'm going to make a stomp rocket car. Um, need three two litre bottles of pop or empty bottles. I'm going to need a bit of cardboard as well and I'm going to use some of my CDs that I've already made into wheels by sticking milk bottle tops in the middle and they're on barbecue skewers for the axles so that'll save me a bit of time and a couple of drinking straws for the axles to go through so tools uh, steel ruler sharp knife, uh, something to make a hole with, and I'll need some scissors as well. We'll make the car first. All we need is an empty pot bottle. It's got a seam down the side of it on both sides that I can use as a reference point for marking out where the axles will go through. It's also got a, a line round the end that I can use, that goes all the way around, so we can use that as a reference. could run some hot glue round there to seal it. I'm not going to. Okay, that's the car ready. Next we need to cut one of these up so we can use it as a strip to fold up into a tube. again in a minute so don't throw it away. Now we've got to roll this up into a tight tube. needs to be thin enough to go inside there. Parcel tape should do. So that's going to go in there. We want to be a bit careful when we stomp on here, we don't want to crush the axle, we don't want any pressure to go on here. So that's what I'm going to use the cardboard for, I'm going to cut a hole in it. And use it to support the front. So that's going to stop us from crushing down on there and breaking the axles. Test run time. I've done a couple of test runs already and got a bit of a design flaw. Because this pipe is rigid coming out the front of the stomp cannon, 
if I jump on the cannon, it actually flicks it up in the air and it lifts the back of the car off the ground. So I can't get a good run if I actually stomp on my stomp cannon. But if I just squeeze it instead, it works fine because we're not lifting the back wheels off the ground. So here we go. Success. Not quite not quite what I intended. I want to be able to stamp on this, but without having a soft tube that will take the stress of the, the stomping, that's the only way I can get it to run, is to squeeze it instead. 